I think we have France and Germany as kind of overseas examples. France, which is what, like 90% nuclear, they're exporting power at this point because they just, they don't, there's too much winning. They don't know what to do with it. <laughs> like they just have too much power, which is just not a problem that anyone else has. Um, meanwhile, Germany got rid of all of its nuclear and they're obviously struggling, especially with, uh, you know, the crisis in Ukraine. Um, because Germany so, was buying all, a lot of natural gas from Russia, right? Because they got rid of their nuclear. Yep. Yeah, exactly. Um, which is also frustrating. I mean, I, I think, you know, when we stop with natural gas, we end up going to coal. But when we stop with nuclear, we end up going to natural gas. So um, we're, we're kind of just speed running, going directly to the worst types of fossil fuels, um, especially when we have sort of these like pipeline uh, disruptions and liquid natural gas, you know, export pauses. Um, it's not that people just go, oh, you know what? I decided that I will in fact rely on solar and wind. You don't, you just get your fossil fuels from elsewhere. Um, well, and and certainly they, <clears throat> it wasn't uh, California doing like a rolling blackout as well at one point during a heat wave where they're like, well, you can only have air conditioning for X amount of time.